Hey everyone, welcome to another training video in SC200 Microsoft Security Operations Analyst series. In this video, I will cover the module on investigate threats using Microsoft Purview Audit. The key module objectives are the differences between the Microsoft Purview Audit standard and the premium plan, how to search for audited activities using the Microsoft Purview Audit, how to implement audit log searching using the audit solution, how to use audit log searching for investigation of common support issues reported to Microsoft support, create audit log retention policies, and perform the forensic investigations of compromised user accounts. My name is Navneet Kumar and I'm a Microsoft Certified Trainer. If you are new to this channel, please do subscribe it for future updates. Without any further ado, let's get started with the module. Audit standard is enabled by default for Microsoft 365 organizations. As a result, there is only a few things an organization must do before it can search the audit logs. And this includes the setting up of the audit standard, verify your subscription, assign the required permissions and search the audit logs. When an audited activity is performed by a user or administrator, an audit record is generated and stored in the audit log for the organization. The audit standard offers the retention of this audit log up to 180 days, whereas in premium, you get it up to 10 years. That is one primary difference between the standard and premium audit. Well, enabling the audit recording from the portal is possible. This can be enabled from the, the Microsoft Purview or the Defender XDR portal. Any of these you can use. It also can be done using the PowerShell in the cloud shell. The Microsoft 365 supports an audit log so that organizations can search it for activities that are performed in different Microsoft 365 services. The steps required to search the audit log within the Microsoft Purview Compliance Portal are you run an audit log search. When doing this, you configure the search criteria like the start date, the end date, type of activities to search for, users to display the search results for, file name or folder name containing the activities with the specified keywords, URL of the file or folders are specified. You view the search results, a maximum of 50,000 events will be displayed in the increments of 150 events and uh, export the search results to a file that can be a comma separated value csv file to the local computer you can export this data to the step one here is export the audit log search results the first step is to search the audit log and then export the results into a csv file to your local system format the exported audit log using the power query editor is the second step the step is where the JSON transforms the features in the Power Query Editor in Excel that comes into play. And this feature will split each property of the JSON object in the audit data column into its own column. Then uh, the PowerShell to search and export audit log records can also be used. You can use a PowerShell command let search hyphen unified audit log is the command in the exchange online PowerShell that you can use to export the results to a CSV file. Use the audit log searching to investigate the common support issues and the organizations can use the audit log search tool to help them investigate the common support issues like finding the IP address of the computer used to access a compromised account, determine who set up email forwarding for the mailbox, determine if a user deleted email items in their uh, mailbox, determine if a user created an inbox rule, investigate why there was a successful sign-in by a user outside your organization, search for the mailbox activities performed by users with non-E5 license, or search for mailbox activities performed by delegate users. The Microsoft Purview Audit Premium provides the 
uh, advanced features that are designed specifically for organizations that conduct the forensics and compliance investigations. This includes the increased audit log retention that can be up to 10 years, access to the crucial events that help determine the scope of compromise, and higher bandwidth access and thus faster access to the Microsoft 365 Management Activity APIs. Audit Premium is available for the organizations with Office 365 E5, A5 or G5 or Microsoft 365 Enterprise E5, A5 or G5 subscriptions. Users must be assigned an Audit Premium license so that audit logs will be generated when users perform these events. Explore the Microsoft Purview Audit Premium features. The Microsoft Purview Audit Premium provides the following advanced features that I mentioned earlier. The one year to 10 year of retention of the data, access to the crucial events that help determine scope of compromise and higher bandwidth access, thus the faster access to the Microsoft 365 Management Activity API. The Premium is available, Audit Premium is available in the following licenses that I mentioned, Office 365, E5, A5 or G5 subscription or the Microsoft 365 Enterprise E5, A5 or G5. Users must be assigned the Audit Premium license so that the audit logs will be generated. I will put a more detailed uh, uh, link, MS Learn link for the comparison of the key capabilities of the Purview Audit Standard and the Premium. Managing the audit log retention policies can be configured and that these logs can be retained up to 10 years. The Microsoft Purview Audit Premium provides a default audit log retention policy for all the organizations. Retention policies can be created based on the criteria like all activities in one or more Microsoft 365 services, specific activities, uh, in a Microsoft 365 service that are performed by all users or a specific user and a priority level that specifies which policy takes precedence when multiple policies exist in the organization. To create the retention policies, a user must be assigned the organization configuration role in Microsoft Purview Compliance Portal. Well, when it comes to the investigation of compromised email accounts, a compromised email account user account is where an attacker gain access to a user account and operates as the user. To help organizations investigate compromised email accounts, the Microsoft 365 audits the access to mail data by mail protocols and the clients. It does so by mail item access to mailbox audit action which can help investigators for better understand email data breaches or identify the scope of compromise to specific mail items that may have been compromised. Organizations should complete the following steps when conducting the investigation. Identify the mailboxes that have been compromised. Determine the time frame when the attacker had access to those mailboxes. Use this search unified audit log PowerShell commandlet and the search mailbox audit log commandlet in Exchange Online PowerShell to search for the audit records that correspond to the data breach. Well, summary of this module is that we have seen the difference between the standard and premium purview audit, how to search for the audited activities using the purview audit, how to implement audit log searching, how to use audit log searching to investigate the common support issues reported to Microsoft support. Microsoft Purview Audit Premium builds on the capabilities of audit standard, how to create audit log retention policies, and how to perform forensic investigations of the compromised user accounts. I hope this module was informative to you. Thanks for watching and do subscribe to the channel if you have not subscribed to yet. Don't forget to visit the description of this video to get the useful reference material. Thank you.